Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to some more. I was going to say ukulele. Nope. Xenoblade Chronicles 2. In the last episode, what we did was we started the game, met our dragon turtle friend Gramps, then we went onwards. I wonder if there's a shortcut to the quest log. It doesn't matter, it's only like one button. Uh, and then we played hide and seek, and it was good times. I enjoyed it a lot. But now we're going to kill some crabs in our first fighting quest, which I hope there are a lot of. Also, now I know that side quests are easy to spot. I'm not going to be so bothered about looking around the map to find them. So mostly from now on, you, you know what's happened, don't you? I'm just going to speak to uh, side quest givers and that's it. So that's going to be fun. Enjoy that. Come here. No! We lost the upper hand! Oh, he saw me, okay. I understand. Ha! Sword Bash has a back attack first, but I'm not gonna be able to back attack things when they're looking right at me. I'm gonna need someone else to take the aggro. We can do this all day! Yeah! Yeah! Give me that so in the beginning it's quite slow, but that's because you haven't got other party members to help you make things quicker. I guess I really am the best. Ow. Then you have to micromanage everyone else's moves too. Sword bash. That's good damage. It'd be better if I could do it from the back, but yeah. you know. Bosh. Okay, ready? Let's do this thing. Anchor shot! Ha! I guess I really am the best. Ooh. Okay, so that's a wide slash. So the wide slash hits multiple people. Big fan of that. Sword bash. And they still say their moves, which I'm a yeah. big fan of as well. Ha. Air slash. Back slash. Ha. Ha. Anchor shot. Ha. Need that in my life. Okay. Let's do this thing. Hopefully it's not too loud so you can still hear what I'm saying. Ha. That's the that's the point. It should be just loud enough that you can hear what I say. They're not so loud that you can't hear anything. I don't want to be so overpowering that you can't hear the game. I don't think the Trent Crabble's going to come back anytime soon. Let's go see the solder now. Let's let the solder know. My problem is I read things because I think I know what they say. And I don't actually take the time to read the sentence before I try and speak it. So I end up making lots of mistakes. I'm back. Thank you. Thanks to you chasing up the Trent Crabbles, I was able to make my delivery. I'm really grateful to you. And that's no problem at all. I'd feel better if someone tough like yourself could guard my wares, but eh, sorry, but no. You know, if those Trent Crabbles come snooping again, I'll hire... Uh, I did it again. If those Trent Crabbles come snooping again, I'll try hiring some mercenaries from Garfon. They say those mercs are buff as buff can be. But I digress. Here, your reward for protecting my wares. Please take it. Thanks. Cargo escort! Ha -ha. With the Crabbles gone, your soldier's trade deal went off without a hitch. In the future, she plans to hire mercenary guards. Development level 1. Oh, so if I do uh, side quest people, I get uh, the area better. That's cool. Kinthia. Hey, I haven't played the coolest thing ever. They're like all kapow and use all these flashy weapons and they fight with the power of friendship, do they? Wow, pretty impressive. When I grow up, I want to be a driver too. Then I can get my own blade and we can be a team and it'll be the best thing ever! Oh my god! Huh. Will it? Hmm. Can't say I share your enthusiasm, but that's just me. I'm just one of those guys, right? Have a rest at the Moor Inn on the third floor, okay? Always good to remember you can check your current objective in case you forget, like me. It's a very huh. useful tip. I wish older RPGs did that too. If you don't play for like two months, you don't know where the fuck you are, so you forget. And it's good just to have something to say, oh yeah, you do this. Let me quickly explain about lodgings. When you take a short vest in a lodging facility like an inn, you can use any bonus XP you've earned to boost your level. Bonus XP is the experience you earn when completing quests or discovering landmarks. Be sure to rest at inns on occasion so you can use it. If you come up against a foe that you can't beat, do a few quests to build up your bonus experience, then go to a lodging facility and level up. On the other hand, if you're the type that likes a challenge, you're free to never level at all at lodgings. It can be fun to live dangerously. Anyway, we've got a big day ahead of you tomorrow, so you better get some shirt eye. Welcome to the Marin, best place of all traders. Now I'd like to rest up a bit. Thank you very much for custom. We has rooms free. 
Oh, I can do a short rest. Is there a way to do a longer rest? Maybe. Oh, I was thinking maybe you can get a uh, XP multiplier. Let's do Rex. Oh, it's bonus XP for everyone. I'm going to use level 5. Yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling stronger than before. Nice. Yeah, finished. Vex is going to be my main character, so he's going to be leveled up a lot. Almost all the bonus XP is going to go to him. That's how I play these sorts of games. One guy, very good. Unless I find someone I really like a lot more. Surely it's so different for sleeping in that little hut on, hut on Gump's back. For some reason I feel like I've gotten a bit stronger. Anyway, better head to meet at the point. It was at the Goldmouth exit dock down on the ground floor, right? I guess there's still time to look around Goldmouth a bit longer if I want to, but I shouldn't dawdle too long. A number of shops are now available for you to use. You'll find a whole range of different traders as you journey across Alvest. Our gentleman trade guild is known as the hub of Alvest commerce, so naturally you'll find a plethora of different shops here. While you're here, you should make it sure you've got everything you need before you head out on your adventures. Ugh, I slept like a baby. Double spinning edge. Pouch setup menu now open. Item trading shops now open. Performance now available. Oh, I forgot to tell you about something important. Vex's pouch. Vex never goes anywhere without his handy pouch. It's great for putting his favourite items inside, so if you can always have them close to hand. Vex's pouch. Ugh, Vex's. For God's sake, Jerry, please. Vex's pouch isn't that big. It can hold just one handy item at a time. So what should you put in your pouch? Well, usually the sort of everyday items you'll find at lifestyle shops. Just keeping them close by can have all sorts of effects. There are 12 different types of lifestyle shops across our list. If you encounter a new one, be sure to check it out. I don't think I've ever been this bad before. Maybe I'm actually becoming ill. I've said it for a long time, so... Right, so... Characters. Pouch. Pouch number one. Let's put... Oh, is this so they can take it on their own? I'm going to take this, because it's clearly one of his favourites. Oh, I don't have a pouch expansion kit. I can make my pouch bigger. So it can only fit one thing in at a time, maybe, right now? Okay. Let's go. Oh, there's even a, a quest that we don't know anything about icon. That's cool. Gagebi. Left all clear, right all clear, front all clear. Go, my fair, okay. But Gagebi's shift not very okay. Really? The Mulu is supposed to take over watch when Gagebi's time is up. But the Mulu, you're 3,821 seconds late. This thousandth time now. And thousandth time, Gagebi, you're missed Indians. That's not good. Gagebi wants to find Lemulu and scold him all day long. But Gagebi must keep watch. Gagebi's so sleepy. Gagebi's so hungry. I'd like to help if that's okay. Mame, you want to help Gagebi? Thank you, Gagebi, I'm so grateful. Please find Lemulu and tell him that it's time to relieve watch. I'll do what I can. Thank you, friends. I'll have a me. You probably find Lemulu watching salvaging. You always love, lose track of time in doing that. Better late than never. Yes! Huh. Oh. I, knew, I knew she was over here, so I didn't mind jumping off the level. Savage is so cool, the Millie could watch it all day. Meh, the Millie feel like he forgot something. So, the thing is... Meh, 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 watch duty. This thousandth time, Gebby gonna get so angry. Meh, meh, meh. Are you alright? The Millie watched Savage so long, he forgot his tumbly was humbly grumbly. Ugh, the Millie cannot move one inch. The Millie shriveled up and die here. Remember the Millie fondly. Hmm, this is awkward. What should we do? Take pity on poor Lemuli. Someone help Lemuli is no good kind people around. If only Lemuli could get Cinnapon rolled from Honeycomb Sweets, Lemuli would have energy to work. Roger. Just one, one single small Cinnapon roll. Please? Cinnapon roll? <laughs> okay. Let's buy some cylinders. So, a silver cylinder costs 1800. Do I get 1800's worth of money out of it? Maybe not. We'll see. I might not do salvaging either, but I, th I think I will. It's just difficult for me to know how much value it's got right now. Sweetie, sweetie confections to purchase here, friends. Bye. Ooh. Cinnapon roll. Let's buy one of them. There seems to be some very expensive stuff too. Can I smith yet? No. I need to be a driver, like, actually to do that. Okay. Huh. I got you your Cinnapon roll, you shit. Get back to work. Guess for something else, I'll be cutting you up into stew. Meh, 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 meh. Here you go. You did it. Cinnabon roll. Let me eat it right now. No, wait, no, no, not time for that. Let me leave a terrible problem. Is something wrong? Well, let me leave stand around dreaming of Cinnabon rolls. Precious treasure got stolen by Sly Crabble. Very, very important pendant from Mamapon. Let me leave get pendant back. Ah, let me leave a good idea. Let's hear the details. Let me leave become Savager and Savage Sky Sly Crabble. Foolproof. Let me start swimming practice. First thing tomorrow. I'd like to help if that's okay. 
Find out Lumilu with swimming practice. Oh, just get Pendant back to Lumilu instead. Yeah. Pen very good and kind to get Lumilu both Cinnabon and Mall as Pendant as well. Slug Crab will probably already return from depths of Cloud Sea. If Lumilu get Pendant, he can work. Lumilu save Cinnabon Mall until Pendant was returned. Pull up that Slug Crab at the Savage deck. Argentum to retrieve the Molly's keepsake necklace. Alright, let's use a normal cylinder. I can do this with a bit of lag, hopefully. I missed the first one again. Ta. Onwards. I always miss the first one. That could have gone better. So it goes to night time. Oh. You get things like parts. I wonder if you can use parts to upgrade weapons. If that's the case, then this is fine. So, is this the salvage deck? Let me make sure I'm doing the right, th right place. Salvage deck. Yes, it is. Okay. I've got to keep digging it then, and eventually I'll find it. All I've got to do is get a perfect one, I guess. It's good practice, isn't it? Let's try again. Time for some treasure I always missed the first one. I did it again. Time! Onwards. Oh man, did I come up with a load of guff again? I think I found it. I'm gonna try and get one perfect with the final cylinder. Okay, bring it on. Yeah. Double spinning edge. Yeah. I'm gonna see what that looks like. Ha! Come kill. Double spinning edge. Bosh, bosh. Sword bash. And then finally anchor shot. Anchor shot. Ha! Combo it up, baby. Why not? 29 damage. Don't feel like ha! I'm doing that much more strength than I was before. Or that much more damage, but it's okay. Maybe 20 strength isn't a lot. It's totally nothing. Right, one more dig. I just want to try and get perfect one oh, time. I can't wait. Yo. Ta. All right. That's that was as good as I can get it, really. Oh, I love the smell of salvage. Nice. So I guess new salvage points may have treasure, and if I keep doing the old one, it might not be good. But I just want to see. What I got out. Treasure acquired. So it costs 1800 for like a normal cylinder. I'm not going to have 1800 left, but maybe it's the stuff inside the chest that I actually care about. Okay, so I should try every new savage point once, and if I perfect it, I'll probably get some good chests. Mmm, Cinnabon Mole's so tasty. Here you go. Now, ah, friends, the Lumini is not eating Cinnabon Mole. The Lumini only eat half the Cinnabon Mole. Meh, the Lumini's pendant. Thank you, listen to the special memories of Mamapon. Looks like everything worked out. Meh, I'm really think too much about Pendant. Forget to believe Gibby of Watch Duty. I'm really not keep Gibby waiting. Bye, friends. I'll report back, alright. I had to see this uh, destruction of this poor pop, uh, knock on. <laughs> Wonder if I'll have any references to Bionis and McConnor here. Thanks a lot. Gigeri passed the watch due to the money, no problemo. Yeah, pretty impressive, right? The Lumini smashed previous lateness record with 7,691 seconds. Because this happened a thousandth time, Gigeri planned an election for three days and three nights. But the Lumini gave Gigeri half of the delicious cinema roll, so Gigeri forgive him. Looks like everything worked out. Gigeri not monster, generosity of Gigeri wide as cloud sea. Yeah, cinema roll make Gigeri sleepy. Here's a reward from generous Gigeri. Thanks. If you see suspicious activity aboard Goldmouth, please report it to Gigeri or Limily. Yes. Quest complete. Leather gloves and wolf shoes. So I guess the quest XP, we never actually use it. We never level up without uh, storing it as bonus experience, so you can use it on whoever you want. That's cool. I guess it's so that if I'm, for example, doing all these quests with Rex on his own, I could still have uh, other characters benefit from okay. me doing quests on Time my own. to take you down. Which seems fair. Ha! 
Now, I guess there'll also be named enemies like there were in the other game. In Xenoblade 1. I never played Xenoblade Chronicles X, by the way, so I don't know what that was like. Wheeling out the maelstrom for this. Banner sure has deep pockets. Gawking at a boat. What are you, 12? Wait, maybe you are 12. What's my age got to do with anything? I can tell an awesome feat of engineering when I see one. You don't close your mouth soon, you're going to swallow a fly. What's her problem? We're nearly the same age. Also, you might want to watch where you stand. Otherwise, when we cast off, that rope will take your leg off. Huh? Gotcha. What, you little? Now look whose mouth's hanging open. Rex, we're heading out. There's no one seeing you off, right? You got night watch. Till then, rest up inside. Aye, aye. Later. <laughs> Before you head off on your big job, I'd like to explain a little something about selling items in our list. You may have already made a use of them, but there are businesses called item trading shops that specialise in taking treasure off your hands. If you sell off items as a whole set, you'll earn a bunch more money than if you sold them off individually. So when you find precious treasures, don't just sell them off cheap at a regular shop. See if you can put together sets for trading shops and make a tidy profit. Huh. So there's a trading shop somewhere. And we'll see if we can trade. Alright, so are you going to actually have things to trade with me? Well, it's always good to see you. You're always welcome. Oh, I can make the set. Right. So I get 300 gold for that. I can get lots of gold for certain things if I have the set. Okay, so that's what salvaging's for. To get money based on making the parts. So you don't get the money back from salvaging, but the, the actual salvage you get can make sets that give you your money back. Okay, cool. Right. Doesn't look like there's any more quests, at least not ones that I can easily see. Never thought I'd see the day you'd be riding the Mael Maelstrom Rex. I suppose it just goes to show how far you've come as a salvager, eh? Well, I'm proud of you, lad. Now, you're set. We're setting sail as soon as you're ready to board. Yeah, I'm ready. That's what I'd like to hear. Come on, then. Hop on. We're heading into uncharted territory for this job, you know. I'm getting goose pimples just thinking about it. Let's do it. Now, nothing will definitely go wrong. CSEV Maelstrom. Now I'm going to need to find out what CSEV stands for, otherwise I'm going to be bothered by a lot. We should be reaching the Enchanted Zone tomorrow, but there's plenty of time left until then. I guess I could go for a talk for the clients for a bit. I still don't know as much about them as I'd like to. Besides, it's not every day you get to talk to real drivers. Oh, and once I'm done with them, I'd better go see Monel. I'm meant to be on lookout duty tonight. He won't be very pleased if I never show up. Maelstrom Interior. Search the maelstrom and talk to the clients. It's brain. Rex, time to eat, drink, and be merry. It'll be a while yet until we reach our destination. Get yourself rested and ready to face the trials ahead. That's the savage away. I'd absolutely love to, but I sort of got guard duty. Ah, that's too bad. Well, make sure you guard like no one's ever guarded before. Even minus tasks like that are part of life's little lessons. Haha. <laughs> Fucking sprain. Right, Nia. You seem awfully quiet. Did you get seasick or something? Of course I'm not seasick. I'm just not used to ships with this many salvages on, that's all. Well, if it's wearing you out now, you'll be a wreck by the time we reach our destination. I can handle it myself, alright? Master Rex, so you are prepared to begin salvaging? Let us all work well together to make this mission a success. Wouldn't have it any other way. What a lad. Hoopinin, what are you doing here? Meme? Plumman is uh, taking vacation. Yes, just going a little pleasure trip. Hmm, that's a little suspicious. Hi, right, Jin. Hi there. You're from Lithuria, are you? Sure am. I was raised in Fonset Village. The village is right by the Cloud Sea, so I grew up swimming in the clouds. That's why salvaging work comes naturally to me. I'm pretty confident in my skills, despite how I may look. Very good. I don't know about you, Jin. Not sure about you. And arrived. Maelstrom deck. Do -do 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 -do. Leslie Dazzly. Rex, you not go see Monel and take over lookout duty yet. Monel's on platform just above here. Steps a bit rickety, so careful you not fall off. Oh, God. Don't 
don't, don't tell me things like that. Malos. What do you want, kid? I'm called Rex, actually. I'm supposed to be working with you. So I'm guessing you're not going to fill me in on what exactly it is we're looking for out here? That's the idea. Need to know basis. Why? Are you curious? Well, sure I am, but I'll do the work I'm paid for whether you tell me or not. That's all I like to hear, kid. I sure hope your skills are more advanced than your age. And then still Rex, not kid. Also, hello, Xenomorph. Hey, 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 evading Malos is attack when you're not even a driver. That's impressive, boy. I look forward to seeing how you handle the work ahead. Is that a compliment? Thanks, I think. You little shit. Gonna waste no time getting up here and talking to Monail. What up, mate? So, you finally arrived, have you? Well, you're here to keep watch, or aren't you? Yeah, let's start the shift. Why not? Uh, at last, I can get a breather. I think I've owed myself a drink or two. I'm not looking too good out there. You'll steer yourself for the worst. If something's up, give me a shout. Don't worry, I won't be drinking myself into a stupor or anything. Hmm. Uh oh. Hmm. Of course. That's a black ship from the harbor. Is it following us? Oof. It's way too cold up here. You? I'll have you know I've got a name. It's Mia. They've started boozing below decks. You should join them. Why aren't you there? It's not that I hate it. I just really don't need a headache right now. Huh. Good thing you're not a salvager, then. Why's that? Swim like a fish and drink like one, too. That's the salvager's code. Pfft, sounds terrible. I don't think I'll be changing careers. Hmm, probably for the best. Anyway, I bet you drivers earn a hell of a lot more than salvagers do. So, kid? My name's Rex. <laughs> okay, Rex. Why did you start salvaging in the first place? That there. The world tree. I don't get it. You know, you find all sorts of things digging through salvage. Some of it trash. Some of it treasure. But all of it from people long gone. Have you noticed, though, there's fewer titans each day? I saw one go under just the other day. It was a pretty big one. There must have been loads of animals still living on it. Living space is running out. Day by day. And sooner or later, we'll be the ones sinking down into the cloud sea. But up there, Elysium is waiting for us. <laughs> Seriously, kid, Elysium, don't tell me you believe that gaff. So that's, uh, why you're a salvager. It's just a lie for children. And that there is just an overgrown shrub. If there's a way to get up there, maybe it's hidden below the clouds. Is it really that crazy? Seriously, though? There'd be no need to fight over dwindling land and resources. No need to worry about our homes sinking away. Everyone could have peace and security. I mean, a dream like that, isn't that worth believing in? Nobody can tell you what to believe, but... <clears throat> Everyone, huh? What? I always thought people were pretty selfish by nature, but you... Huh. Do you have parents? No. When I asked Gramps, he told me they died when I was just a kid. Gramps? Oh, the same one who taught you to use arts. Yeah. He basically raised me himself. He's not like us, though. Not like... I'm not sure I catch a drift. But this Gramps of yours sounds all right. Huh. And you're all right too, kid. All right, Sindera. Not that different from me. It's not like I like you or anything, but bugger. Like I said, animating it up. We're in position. All personnel report to stations. Salvage team, suit up and proceed to hatch. Let's do it. I like a good montage. Who 
opinion on what's happening. What are you doing sneaking about the place? Meme? Never mix mind about Papoonin. We're having to salvaging, Chairman. Expect results. Oh, don't you? We've been working very hard, especially when there's a thousand gold, a hundred thousand gold reward on the line. That's the spirit. Now, quick, quick, come downstairs and head to rendezvous point. All right. Your target is located inside a shipwreck, 450 pairs straight down. Searching the wreck while submerged is too high risk for our tests, so you can we'll up. be using flotation devices and cranes to lift the hull first. Next, you'll split into teams and explore the interior. Once the target is found, retrieval can commence. If that's clear, let's begin with attaching the floats. Get into position. Aye, aye. We're paying you lowlifes a lot, so don't screw it up. You smug so-and-so. I think Guff is just the Xenoblade replacement for shit, so I'm going to read it as shit every time. You don't tell me you believe that shit. Where's my minigame? Nah, no, I'm kidding. Just in case. Our first dungeon, mayhaps? Is that it? Oh dear. It looks pretty ancient. Is that the... Propulsion mechanism? I've never seen one that shape before. Which country made this? Oh, this thing's gigantic. Full-time balloon them. Boss, you're taking this one? I am. Oh, I was kind of kidding. More fool me, I guess. Massive. The appearance matches our reports, but it's what's inside that matters. Object is secure. Proceed to second phase. Jin, what's going through that head of yours, Jin? Excellent work. You're not half bad, you know that. I do this for a living, remember? All teams, proceed. Inside when ready. All right. All right then, let's get moving. You with us? Me? You gonna drag the kids along? Seriously? Guess he thinks you need all the help you can get. Oh yeah. <laughs> There, you've got your orders, haven't you? Yeah, I do. I'm sorry. Ancient ship. This looks like something from Mechonis. It'd be really cool. I can't remember what the enemies are called. Mech something. Fight formation has changed. Don't want to use gin. Gin scares me. 
You just require new comrades to accompany you on your adventure. You can adjust the setup for your party and main menu characters change order. No matter how many friends you make, you will never be able to take more than three party members into battle at once, so choose carefully. The character set to number one in change order will be the character you control. No two characters fight in exactly the same way, so you should experiment with a few and find who fits your playstyle the best. I will, but I'll uh, I'll use these guys for now. Cheers, You're all mine. Always look behind you when you spawn in an RPG. Always. New game, same tricks. There's no telling what you'll find in an undiscovered region. Best to remain vigilant. Got it. Still, you need to be with. You'll be with a bunch of drivers. Drivers have incredible strength, so you'll probably be fine with them. You just concentrate on fulfilling your role in the mission. All right. Let's do it. Show you what a that you do. Oh gosh, yes, Shackham. That's cool. I like I like Shackham. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Focus. Ha. I'm gonna use aggro. Thank you, Bryce, for being online. Yeah. So I don't have to control them, they can do what they're doing. Yeah, that little icon means you're doing good. You're hitting them in the right spot. Goodbye. Amazing. So that's how drivers and blades fight. So ruthless. It's like they're monsters themselves. Nice. I'm sure glad these drivers are on our side. You too, Dromark. No need to get hysterical. It was a walk in the park. Yeah, but still. That's enough yapping, you pair of brats. Let's move! All right, dick. <laughs> Talk about self-important. Gramps always taught me to respect my elders. Elders. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, what are you doing? Why are you being so sneaky for? He's, he's a bad and he's a bad and he's a double agent. They make short work of monster. These no ordinary fighters. Big job in Moradain going well too. There's much money to be made from these people. <laughs> Well, I do what I'm told. Malus is the other guy, by the way. I couldn't remember his name. Malos. Right. Another thing to know, so I haven't got the DLC, so I can't do the Torna DLC or whatever. If I start making, you know, enough money to be able to afford things like that, I'd definitely play it. So based on what I've seen so far, I like the game a lot. But we'll, we'll see how it progresses. Right, so Nia. I just want to see if I can see their skills or anything. I can't. Okay. Right. I'll let drivers and blades go in first, but it's chock full. Oops. Yeah, better leave the rust of flow that to the pros, eh? Okay, let's go in. It's time to let you know in on a handy battle tactic how to lure enemies. If you target an enemy from a distance without drawing your weapon and first down, you can lure the enemy towards you. It's useful to take out a herd of enemies one by one if when you prefer to fight an opponent in a wider space. Try luring out the enemy in front of you now. Press R and then down to lure it over. And hit! Oh, I can smack it for like one damage with a stone. Okay. Okay. Time to take you down. Bubble Medusa. Yeah. Me. Good name. Come on. Yeah. You're oh, they do way more damage than me. Ha. Anchor shot. Ha. I guess Nia's getting more experience because she's a lower level. I just wanted to see if anyone had like heals or something. It's okay. I like a healer in my party at all times. Okay, let's go down here then. I found something. Found something. I I like the xenomorph's uh, voice. Found something, yes. Let's show him a thing or three. <gasps> Make sure you got my tail racks. 
do it. Another thing I liked about these games a lot is the uh, character discussions during a fight. They'll say things and they'll uh, have like big battle conversations. It's really cool. My lady, I would advise you to put more thought to your defense next time. I'll be fine. You're all mine. Offense is the best defense, right? Give me that. First skill I want to get is magnet grab or whatever. If there's one like that, I can just grab money from a distance. I like that. How the fuck am I going to get over there? Shit. Sorry, Matt Loss, I pushed you off. Okay, let's keep going. Hold number one. Okay. I guess we're going to fight all of them. Let's try it. Let's how. I'll see how we manage in a uh, in a group battle. Hey, they defected it. Yeah. Yes, we're fighting all three now. Yeah. And if there's any AOE moves, we can. Yeah. I know double spinning edge looks like it should be one. Yeah, yeah Nia does heal me. Cool. Oh my. Give me that potion. Oh, I guess someone else used it. It's okay. Or maybe it heals everyone when they use it. That's another reasonable explanation. Yeah, I'm, I'm fighting everything in here. Just so you're clear. No! We lost the upper hand. Oh, I've got to draw my weapon. I keep forgetting. If I just went into them without drawing my weapon, they attack me first. We run back. Oh, he's broken. Oh, no, he's toppled. That's really bad for him. You can't attack or anything when you're toppled. I mean, you're level 4. I guess their stats are just accelerated or high because they are drivers and I'm not. I'm just a pleb. Okay, time to take do, do, you do, do, down. Do, do. Let's see what you got, kid. Oh, without drawing my weapon. How do I put my weapon away again? I don't remember. It's okay. I'll target this guy because I can actually hit him. Yeah! Attack! <laughs> I do like the fact that I only have to really control what Vex is doing right now. That makes my life a lot easier. It would be better if I, if I can set them to do certain things when certain conditions are met, like FF12. Also, I'm doing three episodes per session, so I guess if I find out that in the first session the audio is a bit bad, it only takes three videos okay, to fix it. Bring it on. So it won't be too bad. I think this is fine. I might make it a little bit quieter again, but. Lethal Lysat. When is the bestiary? Get them all in. You <laughs> Easy peasy. Yeah, me and Malos are about time to take you down. In terms of uh, skill. Yeah. Oh, I can hit you from here. All right. I wonder what the bar on the top left is. It's all like a special gauge, like in Xenoblade One, where you uh, can do special moves occasionally. Like a limit break. And hit. Of course, enemies respawn, so I'm not going to spend all my time just fighting over and over and over again, because you'll be here forever. Not even as a joke. And hit! Just ow! Get stoned, son. Are you stuck over there? Just so. Let's show him a thing or three. I can take care of myself. No problem. Yeah. I'm going to hit you from up here. See if I give a shit. Bye. <laughs> Gotta go get the money though. I know it's only like seven gold or whatever, but it all adds up. If you start forgetting the pennies, then you lose the pounds. Treasure you know? acquired. 
Right, so let's see if this treasure is something I can actually open. I'm guessing not. But so I think the purple two that appears over people's heads occasionally is the skill points. Treasure acquired. Oh, I could get that. Attack stone. Hmm. Can I see other people's equipment? Why is that not working? Oh. I was pressing the wrong button. No wonder. Okay, I can't do anything else besides... Increases auto attack damage by 20%, but lowers my strength, so it's probably just as bad. Increases HP restored to self, not using HP potions by 10%. Okay. I can't change anyone else's equipment. That's fine. Alright, affinity chart, let's see. 342 skill points. 20 strength. Agility. Use the driver art assigned to X at the start of battle. Increases either by 20. Increases the HP restored by reviving a teammate. Alright. Enhance arts. Increase damage by the back by 100, but my damage ratio goes up. So it's not increasing the amount of damage I'm actually doing yet. That's fine. Okay, we'll keep. I'll leave this for now. I'll, I'll wait until I have a lot of WP and then start upgrading things on mass. Fine. So I guess I wasn't supposed to be going upwards. Although it is quite dark, so I might just be getting confused. Let's just keep exploring. Go to places I haven't been to before. Might make more sense, wouldn't it? Yeah, that's the entrance to the ship. And I've been up here. So I guess downwards and then behind me is where I want to go. Oh. Ow. Okay. Oh, I need to get down there somehow. Okay. Oh, God. No! We lost the upper hand. Yeah. I thought that might happen, but I just ignored it. Yeah. I was like, yeah, this won't happen, really. It's not, it's not true. I like how frantic it is. The combat seems like it's not going to take very long. Just good times. Hey, Nia, I just found the shiniest trinket. You want to see? Hey, Nia? Yeah, yeah, I'll check it out later. Such a child. Yeah. He just wants to show you she's, you know, interested in his art. You know, it's like it. It's not childish, it's a, you know, a special thing for friends, partners, allies to do. My lady, Bosch, I would advise you to put more thought to your defense next time. I'll be fine. So how do I get up there? Offense is the best defense, right? How do I do that? Is there a box I can push? Box pushing? Maybe I can get back up here now. Now the whole floor collapsed. Yeah, that's it. You just jump down here. Treasure acquired. Give it to me. Oh shit. No. Okay, hang on. I'm coming. My name coming. Don't go anywhere. Don't miss a gold and especially not a silver. Oh, okay, good. Huh. Why would you be okay with missing the gold but not the silver, especially? Shut up. Right. Uh oh. Okay. Time to take you Duckle down. Paggle. Stay in your toes. Let's do this. Watch out. Yeah. I, owe you <laughs> I like how well tracked it. It's good. She's from the valley. Anchor shot. Right. right, let's turn down the sound a little bit more. We're going to go down to minus 20.2, and we'll see if that makes it any better. Hopefully it is not just so loud you can hear me a little bit better. I don't need to do a lot, just a bit. Loading bay. Is this an actual part of the map I can get in? Oh, it's a different floor. Okay. I thought the map was just ending. Not so. Let's show him a thing or three. I'm shaking. Let's do this. I like how slow you are when you move with this sword. Ha! 
I guess it's so you can't just run away while you're trying to fight. Which means I definitely need to learn how to run away. Oh, you hold R and then you press down. Okay. Or B. Put your sword away. Okay. I guess that is so. Try, good from a game designer's perspective. I try and understand why everyone does the things they do. I guess that's so you don't accidentally do it. No one wants to accidentally do it. Okay, time to take you down. I can take care of myself. Okay, let's do this. You see, the AI automatically put their weapons away when they think they're too far away from an enemy. I don't. I wonder if there's some way to blow up that door with an explosive or something. Maybe not. But we'll give it a good go. Become killed. Yep. Okay. Time to take you down. I'll do it, I please. Wonder if there's an easy way to change target. If you press R, I guess it brings you the closest one. Or I guess you can do this. Yeah, and that switches it too. Just hold R and then press A or Y. We're done here. Let's go. You're really Level strong. six. We get everyone up to level five, yeah. let's say. Before we move on. Now the question is, does Jin get any experience at all from being here? Or does he need to be in the active party? Yeah. I'd expect him to have to be in the active party. Much, much stronger. Gemini okay. Luke. Survival to survey. Do they automatically assign their own moves as well? I guess I'll be able to do it later. So they're all water-based enemies. So I mean, our guys do water-based attacks. You want to see? Hey, Nia? Yeah, yeah, I'll check it out, Victor. You're such a child sometimes. Okay, let's go. Downward. No, I don't think I can get in there yet. Maybe I can get up from a different angle. A wee. Huh. I refilled my stake. All right. You're all mine. Give me the treasure, money. Yum. I don't know how much equipment's actually going to be yet, but probably quite expensive. And arrived. System control room. Ether fuel chamber. Probably would work with fuel, so I need to find some fuel. Okay. Are we going to try and sail this thing? I doubt it. How's that going to work? Oh god, level five. Okay, good. No, we lost yeah. the Let's do this. Yeah. I want to find the green name enemies. Oh, this guy's a lot more tanky already. Kaboom. Okay, time to take you down. I can trust him myself. He's not messing around. Yeah, well, I'm sort of the player who always looks to go for just massive attack damage all the time. Also, I don't seem to have MP, so I can just. Just cooldown reduction. Use my moves as soon as I get them. Break him. We didn't break him. It's okay. Using Agua. Nice. Right. There's that. There's a guy here. Or a cylinder bank. It's an objective, not a guy. Eat the cylinder. Cool. So we're going to plug this in, it's going to open the door, and then we're going to go fight the boss, and it's going to be great for the end of our second episode. See, so I'm going to record three a day, so over the course of four days I'll make 12 videos. And that way every five weeks I'll have... Um, no, every four weeks... No, I'm an idiot. Every five weeks I'll have 60 hours worth of content. So 60 videos. Here we go. So 12 videos a week. In five weeks, I'll have 60 videos. Which is 12 weeks of content. 
on the channel, which is all good. Right. Open. Also, I'm not a big cat fan, but I do like the white tiger a lot. Hello, buddy. Me old fruit. Also, if I only play for three hours every day, I can get stretched and sit, stand up right, so I don't break my own legs. Not planning on letting us pass, huh? Sounds like a challenge. Old boss team, let's go. Megalo Alligator. Let's see what you got. Focus. Maybe I should use Jin. Bad time to feel like you're gonna cough. I'll, I'll, I'll manage it. Oh, they are. That's really cool. I was gonna say, I hope the AI are smart enough to go and get the um, HP potions on their own. They are. Look at that See that face. aura effect glowing it's around the enemy? Red. This indicates the enemy is in a rage state. Certain enemies have a tendency to become enraged with HP dips below a certain level. Enemy stats will increase when enraged, so be careful, they might be tougher than you expect. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do this. Yeah. Let's yeah. And then you can do even further than topple if you manage to hit them more. Like stun. Yeah. Nice. Jin, check this out. There it is. Adam's crest. Adam's what now? Adam's crest. What does that mean? You. Open this door. Me? This door will only open to one of you people. One of me? What are you talking about? Hurry up and do it! We're not paying you to ask dumb questions. What the hell? You can't treat hired hands like that. Now, how do we open this thing? Push your hand against it, I guess. Oh, hey! So that was a release toggle. Just as I thought. Wait. There. Open that door too. Can they go in here? Or is it just for me? Let's move. No, I guess they can. Okay. What? What is that thing? It's a girl. Oh my. It's not the Monado. Even think about touching that, huh?
don't take it personally. It's an act of mercy. At least you won't be alive to see what's coming. Let's ship out the Aegis. Nia, call the Monoceros. Well, good game, everyone. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next playthrough. Oh, wait. Oh great, I'm in Majora's Mask on the moon. Go to the girl on the hilltop. Uh, I'm guessing I'm dead. You know, the usual. Girl, what is you wearing? Uh, excuse me? Such a mournful sound. Huh? It hasn't stopped. Not. Not in all these years. Hasn't stopped? You mean that bell sound? Is the Praetorium somewhere nearby? Uh. Where are we? This is. Elysium. The land where long ago. Mankind lived in harmony with their creator. It's where... we were born. Get out! R really Is that a core crystal? You're a... blade? My name is Pyra. What? Oh, right. M mine is... I know you. You're Rex, right? How did you know my name? Just now, when we came into contact. Just now? Sorry. I can't seem to remember how I got here. You were... killed. Stabbed through the heart by Jin. Jin? Through the... I remember now. That bastard stabbed me! Oh man! This is bad! Everyone in the guild is in danger! Where are you no, going? Wait, I can't do anything if I'm dead. Titan's fucked. If I wasn't dead, I'd kick that guy's ass. Rex, I have a request. Can you take me to Elysium? Elysium? But isn't that here? This world is merely a memory. An ancient, half-forgotten memory of what once was. The real Elysium lies in your world. Atop the world tree that rises from the heart of all rest. Memory? So it's like an illusion. But there's no way. I'm dead, remember? How can I help if I'm not breathing? 
I will give you half of my life force. That way, you can be revived. As my driver. As the driver of the Aegis. The driver of the Aegis? What, what the... What will you do, Rex? Is this place really your home? It is. And it really exists. Rex, I know what you're thinking, and you are correct. By coming to this place, you can save the world. Save it from the slow demise that is its fate. We wouldn't have to live in fear. Then there's only one choice. I'm in. Let's go to Elysium. I'll take you there myself. Thank you, Rex. Now place your hand on my chest. What? Are you sure? Well, sweet. Near and um End Like what? The price for their lives has already been paid in full. Now that we have finally obtained the Aegis, the fewer living souls know about it, the better. I, I can't do that. These people haven't done anything wrong. I don't understand you. Now now. Have you forgotten why you came here to begin with, Nia? No, but... Oh, for the love of... Fine, I'll handle it myself. What the... sword can't be it's kind of low to stab a man in the back you bloody psychopath pyra here cover me got it jin leave him to me ah! <gasps> sorry kid i can't let the likes of you just claim her power for yourself this is as far as it goes Yeah! Aegis, over here! Just leave it out! Give it a rest, Malos! Can't you see he's just a child? A child? Don't make me laugh. This kid has yeah. made himself the Aegis's driver! 
Thanks, Pyra. You're welcome. Now, don't let up! Yeah! Ha! Ha! Ah! Everybody, go! No! Quick! Yeah! Mallow, here! Can a nobody like you? Ah, but with those eyes, I guess I should have been more wary from the start. What do you mean? Like I tell you. Good, they got away. Now let's fight. Next time. See you guys then. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye!